Hello and welcome everybody. This is not your normal intro. No, no, no. We're going to be... I'm going to just um, straight up explain why these videos are so late. I know, like, I've had my excuses before, but recently my m mom had some medical surgery for some medical reasons and such. I don't want to go too in detail about it. The surgery was successful for the most part, however, in the last two days and such, as of recording this portion, because it is Saturday, or, yes, I will no, it's Friday. Yeah, it's Friday still, at least for, like, 45 more minutes. I'm recording this, and, um, she's been still recovering for the last week and such, but the last few days have been a little bit rough for her, and I've been taking care of her and such, which is why I was late on getting these videos up. Along with a whole issue with my microphone that happened on the first day, it basically took my time for that day for editing and recording to basically re-recording it properly for both videos, in fact. And then today was basically a disaster in editing for the first video to the point that I just, like, got it out and was, like, done. So. I do apologize for these videos being late. You're probably getting this video second as opposed to first, which I usually do the paid for por portion first, but I decided to do it second. However, I hope you guys still enjoy this video. I had some fun making them, even if I don't sound like it for both of them, but I did have loads of fun, and I'm just sad that it's gone this way already because I was hoping with this DLC and such I was going to get back into a proper schedule flow because I had been working on multiple videos and such the last few weeks. I've got more p videos planned, a new series for Jurassic World Evolution 2 along with tips and tricks videos planned and I was ready to have this week started out. December was gonna start big and strong and get the channel back but Unfortunately, didn't go out as planned as usual, but hopefully, starting at least next week, we're a lot more smoother. So you'll be getting these videos, like, on the same day. Obviously, you should be if this is second. If not, then I'm sorry again. But, hope you guys understand, and now, let's get to the real video. Alright, let's take attempt number two at recording this video, along with the others. Hello everybody, and welcome to a Jurassic World Evolution 2 video. I'm your host, Rex's Gaming Bro. Hope you subscribed, and if not, well, fine then. Just keep watching anyway. <laughs> okay, that was, that was terrible, but we're gonna keep it in to show how pathetic that was. We are in Jurassic World Evolution 2, as I said, in the Malta map, the showcase map, as you guys are well aware, because we've got some dinos to look at. Well, obviously, why do you think we're in a game called Jurassic World Evolution 2? We ain't here to look at pig iguanas. Sorry, Nick Van Owen. Maybe next time. But after realizing that partway through recording this portion of his um, review, Realizing he forgot to turn back on his microphone for recording, which, hello microphone, you are on this time, and if not, I'm going to cry, but we are going to st Do you have to be so loud, helicopter? Let's just go on to the first species before I just lose my mind entirely, if I haven't already, and it is the Gigantoraptor, or Giganotoraptor. Ooh, 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 that's a nice red with, oh, 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 that blue, oh my god, that blue one is heaven, ooh, oh, that's cute, kind of reminds me of the Sukumimus animation, just a little bit different and such, but, I mean, this over, this Gigaraptor is like, that one is awesome. Though I will say, and I love how they're walking, like, look at them, they're like, they're proper chickens going, bah, 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 bah. no need for editing, Austin, here. We just gotta use the sound effects of our voice. Yeah, 
Yeah, so they like flap their wings and then do a little bit of a, hey, look at my neck and how tall I can reach it up to the sky. And then they do the chicken box dance. Bark, bark. Finally, we got someone eating. Now, how do they, ooh, they take, ooh, they take big chunks. A little bit of communication there, little chirping chirps, very nice. Oh god, Blue, Bluey's coming in. It's getting a little cramped here, guys. Oh, he's, that guy's like, uh, any room for me? He's, they're like, no, Bob, get your own food. It's like, that's the only one. So get out of my way. Oh, he's coming in now. He's like, hey, I want my food. I'm hungry. I want meat back on the menu, boys. But too bad, because we're going to see how you fare against, uh, say, a Therizinosaurus. Well, that's the wrong one. Right one. A Therizinosaurus first, perhaps. Let's see how you handle the Turkey of Doom. The real Turkey of Doom. Ooh, ooh, they're circling. Whoa, ooh, oh, oh, God. Therizinosaurus gets the first hit. That's not a noise at all. Oh, I don't know who's gonna win. I, I, this one should be weak. No. Hold on, this one should be weaker, right? I put him to like full weak. Oh god. Oh no, that's the wrong fairy. Uh, uh. ACU before he kills them. Uh, can you? I need to get a different fairy. Or is it just gonna be a bite off? Oh. Oh, it, it's not a bite off, but it's a kick off. Which. Quite brutal way to go out, if you ask me. I mean, if you ask a cassowary or a ostrich or something, they'll do it for you. But, um, yeah. Un ah, that's a little unfortunate, I gotta admit. I was hoping he would do something. But, um, let's try... Uh, Spinosaurus. I know that the Frontier said that this guy doesn't hunt, but they did say he fights some stuff. Ooh, hoo hoo hoo, a blue boy today. Now this one, please tell me this one is... Wi okay, this one is set correctly. He will die quickly. Now uh, let's see, how does this go? Ooh, ooh, a ki ooh, damn, he did some damage. That's a straight up kick. Are they gonna keep going? Oh, oh, oh! Why'd it go so quiet? Oh, oh okay, so what, what just happened? All right, now that we have those turkeys going off into the sunset, probably to one of our other facilities, we're going to move on to the, probably most people's favorite and definitely uh, awesome inclusion, one that I didn't expect to ever show up, the Utah Raptor. Oh, oh he bolted in. Oh. My. God. Look at those colors. Look at the red and green on this one. Look at the blue on this one. Look at it. It's like freaking lightning. Oh my god, that is gorgeous. And I think the thing I love about it is it's not overwhelmingly too colorful. Like, it's vibrant, but it's not like taking over the entire body like some of the other skins. Like... Like Allosaurus is, for example, like, I love Allosaurus, but I don't like putting patterns on him because the spots are just too bright and don't really blend in well. But this, like, this just blends in beautifully, like, on both of these two. And I don't even mind that it has, like, the Velociraptor barks, but they're kind of pitched a little bit um, deeper, which 
is kind of I think is kind of a nod to the Isle because I'm pretty sure in the Isle the Raptors just have that. But damn, like yeah, that thing is ter. This guy is terrifying. Also, I'd love to see what like Jim Kirkland would say about it because like I just watched um a video with him interviewing the Gaming Beaver and such, and they were looking over you the Raptor designs, and I was like, now I'm thinking, what would he think of this one? I don't know. But let's look at the other two. Ooh, not bad, not bad. Nice, ooh, black is green is yellow mix here. Not bad on the wings. Nice reddish brown. I like it with the yellow sphere. Very nice. And there's the ultimate. And ooh, ooh, not bad either. Damn, this guy is good with skins. I can't wait to get in the species viewer and just see all of them, but like, yeah, you, I just did my ranking video, like, a month ago, like, it released a month ago, and, um, already it's like, really? Now where am I g gonna put these guys? Because these guys are already top-tier quality. Oh, someone's here for food already. Oh, let's take, oh, he's getting barked at. He's like, hey, I wanted that slice of beef. Ooh, ooh. Oh, well, no animations there. Must have just been going for a little snack. Oh, wait, is he fighting? Well, that's a little aggressive, don't you think? You're supposed to be friends. Oh, well, God, someone's running. Oh! Oh, a roll. Oh, wait. Also, we should probably get a goat, actually. Because I want to see how they do with the group little um, animation. Because they have a group, like, hunting animation where, like, a goat will just, like, be like, Oh, God. Oh, oh, there he goes. Jesus, where's the goat? I, I've lost it. Oh, God. Oh, oh, God. Oh, he just roared at him. He's like, hey, I wanted him. So, that is part of the free update, which I'll tell... Oh, wait. No! <laughs> That's so cute! They just murdered the goat, and now it's like, oh, you cute. Oh. That goat's like, really? Can't you have sympathy for me more than two minutes? My horn's going through the floor after all. Well, oh, oh god, they're going for another one. Hold on, hold on, let's get over there. Which, that was a cute animation. I love how they make them get these cute animations for the dangerous ones. Like T-Rex and all that. Alright, so, we'll slow it down. So they both are... Oh, look at those wings! That goat's like, oh crap. I thought I could get away. So, like, as you can see, like, it's this guy obviously doing the hunt, but now we have the illusion over here making it seem that they're both going on the hunt. And he's, like, looking at this guy just lying down on the job, like, are you for real? Like, why do I have to do everything? And this guy's like, I'm gonna get breakfast. Even though, wait, didn't this guy just kill that one? Jesus, hogging all the kills. And... Oh, in the bush, where no one will see anything except us. Oh, oh, that shut up. That silenced him. He's like, what did you do? What have you done? And he's like, I didn't do anything. <laughs> and he laughs. <laughs> that just sounded so funny. <laughs> he's like, <laughs> oh, now you're going to eat it? It's like, okay, after two, I guess I can have a snack. Now that we've seen him eat meat and goats let's uh where is it nope that's the wrong one it's pyroraptor first that we want to see let's see how it does against say a pyroraptor the previous all-time feathered raptor but now he's got competition i like both of them i definitely like both of them Oh, God. Oh, oh, wait. Whoa, whoa. Are they chasing the raptor? I've never seen that. He just, like, up and bolted for him, and that pyraptor was like, I'm out of here. He's too crazy. Oh, God. there goes another goat in the background. Oh, they're going for the roll again. Oh, you huge. So oh, there we go. Hold on. Let's see. How does he do? Oh, oh. Oh, 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 that was vicious. Ooh. Well, he's regretting his life choices. Get it. Oh, slow-mo it. Rolls him over. 
grabs at his neck, and... Oh, oh, hold on, he's looking at him, he's holding his jaw, damn! That's vicious! And that just looks so beautiful, like, right there, the colors. And then, gives a good old tug. But damn, the detail of him, like, gra uh, uh, hi! No, oh, run away! He's he broke the fourth wall. He's coming after me. Well, we'll try homalocephal. Why did I make so many? Let's try the ultimate victim testers. If there's any brutal animations of awesomeness and cruelty, it's with these guys. Oh, oh, somebody's already. He's like, oh, I see breakfast again. Oh, he stopped. He's like, okay, I'll leave you guys be. You guys are too cute. Oh, there we go. We got someone who's gonna get ready to hunt. Let's see, is it the same as the goat? Oh! Oh no! It isn't! Though not as brutal, I would say. Going slow-mo, so... Steps on him, grabs the neck, gives it the good old Yankee Yankee Doodle. Ooh, that is just sinister, right in the shadows. I cleaned up the dead, and they're already going for it. Let's take a look in capture mode, shall we? Ooh, we got the red-green. Ooh! Oh! Oh! Okay. Change of source. Absolutely obliterated him. Aren't these guys modified? I modified all of them. Yeah, he's got strong defense fit. Please tell me I didn't make the same mistake as with the fairy. No! He's unfit and he's weak and he still killed him. What? Yeah, even this this Utah Raptor's calling bull on that. When you're out here, you're probably thinking, huh, that gate shouldn't be opening. Wait a minute. There's dino people. Oh, oh, there we go. Oh, oh, God. Okay, that was, oh, what, what, what kind of poses? He's like, oh, thanks for the hug. Let's see, how scared is this woman? Well, I can't see it in that angle. Let's try capture mode. No, oh, she's like, oh, God damn. <laughs> that's not a face of fear. That's a face of, God dang it, this is just not my Thursday. And this guy's like, oh, thanks for the hug. That should be the thumbnail. It's like, huggies all around. The raptors do love giving hugs. Okay, so... We'll, we'll keep this in slow-mo. So, it looks like he, um... Oh, God. Uh... Okay, that's gotta be a thumbnail right there. That could be, like, the centerpiece. Oh, look at that. Molt in the background. That's just... That is pure evil eyes right there. He's like... I hate to be the bearer of obvious news, lady, but you're about to die. And that's that's so creepy. See, feathered dinosaurs can be creepy. All you have to do is give that expression, and um, you look at him. He's, like, literally so happy with himself. He's like, I got a hug, and now I'm going to eat the one who gave me a hug. It's a win all around. So anyway, it looks like he um jumped in front, Oh, oh, head tilt. Oh, God. Well, well, um, that's inappropriate because it looks like he just bit her breast off and that killed her. Which, um, I guess, especially in these times, people are so sensitive about everything. No one will worry. Oh, there we go. This guy's like, oh, nobody's going to worry. Okay, boom. Oh, still though, why the press? And why is that guy just sitting there like nothing's going on? You just watch someone get yeeted here and someone ripped in apart here.
And now that we've had our little bit of fun with the Utah Raptor, let's move on to one that is probably the one species I've wanted more than any that have yet to be in the game, and probably the one I'm most interested in, the Concavenator. Oh, ooh, hoo, hoo, that sounds nightmarish and looks the part as well. Oh, of course, now Isaac wants to talk. Well, whatever. Too bad, Isaac. I don't care. But damn, this is absolutely gorgeous looking. And let's actually release two more because apparently they can only release two, which is weird because, well, they're not that big. Oh, this one's even better. Ho, ho, ho. Look at that girl. That bluish green, well, more of a greenish gray, actually. Oh, and look at it. It looks awesome. The hump, the little quills of, like, those quills look deadly. And then we'll get them a feeder and such, and also a goat feeder. Because, you know the tradition, we gotta see how he does against them. Oh, we're getting the social animation. Hold on, let's get this in capture mode. Hold on. Okay, so a little shake. He's walking up. Oh, <laughs> okay, so he nips at his tail, and then he retaliated on him, and just, like, just... That was a horror scream there. And he just looked like a puppy who was like... No, I didn't do it, Bob. I swear, I didn't steal your food. What is he running after? Is he running after the goat? It's on the other side. Oh, he's pan. He's like, guys, guys, I'm scared. I'm scared. I don't like this. What is he panicking over? There's nothing in here but him and his siblings. Is he scared of the goat, perhaps? How does this one eat meat and flesh? Does he eat it right off the bone? Or is he just walking past it? Oh, I love the purple on him as well. This is a nice skin, I gotta admit. Oh, wait, another one's coming in. What's the little group thing gonna be? Are they gonna... Oh, 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 he throws it up. Oh. Ah, a little bit of attention there. He throws it at him and is like, um, nah, I'm not going to risk that. But let's throw in some home allocephale, you know, the victims of seeing how creative of killers we have in this park. I know, guys, you're contemplating your existence. Do you have any other reason to be here other than be cute and die horrific deaths that make us shatter our souls? Well, we'll find... Oh, wow, they, that one didn't waste time. He's like, <gasps> food! Let's see, how brutal is it going to be? Oh! Okay, so it's the same animation as the Utah Raptor from the looks of it. So, unfortunately, nothing unique there, but... I mean, understandable, they are of a similar size. But, um... Wait, why do I have all these? They can't take on any of these guys. I mean, well, except for these. Let's try them out against True Theomimus, perhaps? How long will the Beckys last? Well, they already know to run, so... Longer than expected. Oh, looks like we're going to see that now. How does Indoraptor die? Is it pretty much like... Oh, wait, whoa. What? Hold on, hold on. Oh, oh, it's a scratch attack for the defense. No, what? Whoa, whoa, whoa. These guys are modified, right? Oh, my God. Indoraptor, you beast. This Indoraptor is fully modified to be as, like, ineffective against animals as possible. 
and yet he just freaking oh my god look at them they're all hoppity skippity yet realistically they're they're under oh god there's no way that one escapes this time yeah okay there we go we got one concavenator going let's see oh 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 whoa oh okay he just freaking yeeted him he grabbed his arm and just went hi and threw him into the ground and he just like hopped like he was a pebble what the why are three of them over here look you can't go swimming in the bathtub guys okay he's got them garnered he's got them garnered folks so let's take a look see um right about here so slow mo it so he grabs him by the arm and oh is he gonna throw him into the other guy oh no into the wall oh oh god well it could have been worse honestly you could have been thrown into this guy he managed to get away for now dun 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 the sequel he kills him next or that guy whoever oh why would you look back buddy you fool that's how you know you're dead If there are no more further interruptions, let's take a look at the Tarbosaurus. Ooh, from the side. Ooh, from the side. A little bit cautious. Ooh, there's another one. And oh, <laughs> ooh, very cautious, boys. Ooh, the sinister music is indeed sinister. So Tarbos Tarbosaurus, look at him, or her, you know, absolutely gorgeous in the colors. And for the design, eh, you know, well, it's a Jurassic World design. They're, they're not the best when it comes to, like, these ones, unfortunately. But you know what? I still like it. I like that it's different. To be clear, guys, this is the Camp Cretaceous Hidden Adventure model and unfortunately we do not have a paleo accurate one to go with it but I, I guess it makes sense I don't see why they would unless like if they had have done it on its own then that would have been fine but since we have a Hidden Adventure one don't understand why they wouldn't but let's take a look since I got another batch here let's see how they look the other way. Oh, come on. Can I get another camera angle? I'm pretty sure there's another one. Ooh, we got a green boy. Ooh, two green boys. Did I make the same one? If this is on random generator, then why is it the exact same? Ooh, I love how its calls are nowhere near the same as T-Rex's. Like, I mean, in all the trailers and stuff for the, um, Hidden Adventure, it was the T-Rex calls, but, like, no, they have their proper ones. Oh! All of the sniffy sniffs! Oh, oh, glad sniffy sniffs. He's like, hey, no sniffing my face. Sniff my butt. <laughs> Why'd I go there? <laughs> so let's see, we can see if they have different attack animations. Eh, uh, no. I do have a certain... Oh, oh look at him roll! Look at, oh, look at him go! He's so cute! Oh, he's a big puppy! Oh, why do they make the most terrifying dinosaurs have cutest animations? They're so cute! Who will hunger for the flesh of a goat first? Oh, it's a green one! <coughs> Let's see, how does he go after the goat? Is it the same as a T-Rex? Oh, oh no! Oh, it's worse! He slams him on the ground! And he phases through a tree. A truly terrifying display of power. Run, goat, run! There is no escape, goat. 
And so he snaps him on the butt. Oh. Oh, he throws him around twice for good measure. Not actually hitting him on the ground. Just like the whiplash is probably killing him, along with the teeth. And then flicks him into that nice little muzzle face. Right. I made another batch because I want to see some more skins. And let's see. Ooh, oh, oh, we got a new look. Oh, a lower angle. Nice. Oh, this is like as if it's the security camera. Nice. Oh, hi. Uh, oh, 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 whoa. We got nice. And then we've got nice. Look at that. Ooh, are they going to do the animation again? Yeah, chop. That was almost my nose. Let's, uh, let's start with the Edmontosaurus. I haven't used Edmontosaurus in so long, actually. I mean, I, I better use it in my mini Sorna play throw because if I don't use it, then I'm going to riot on myself. I just realized I just spoiled what's coming to the channel, guys. Uh, surprise! Ignore everything I just said. Oh, look at him sleeping. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Looks like he might be going for one of them. Is it the goat? Is it the goat? Oh, it's the goat. Edmonton's like, oh my god, thank you, goat. Oh, come on. <laughs> He's like, oh, crap. I'm out of stamp. I'm out of juice. And it's not like a... Oh, wait, so what is the animation? Oh, it's... Ah, uh, it's the same as T-Rex's. A little snappy nip, and then the... Tug him down. I would have really liked if he could have, like, just knocked him over and, like, he flipped him. I feel like it's something he would do, like, really. Reminds me, we should probably see how a certain Tarbosaurus does in comparison to a T-Rex. And what better T-Rex for a Camp Cretaceous hidden adventure creature to go up against than a Camp Cretaceous T-Rex named Big Edie? An underrated Rex. Already you can tell that T-Rex is way bulkier and bigger. Like, Tarbo looks sumo, but yeah, the T-Rex still looks bigger. Thank God, I was worried about that. Like. It's one thing that I was really mad about with um, the Hidden Adventure, because they were way too close in comfort, but... Oh, looks like my favorite Tarbo here is going to go up against Edie. Yeah, so let's um pause. And already lower down. Yeah, you he's not as big. I Oh my god, that was something I was worried about. Even his head is smaller, which is good. Okay, now I think Big Edie is going to lose because I have a weak. Oh, wait, she survives the... Ooh. So it looks like... Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. That was a massacre. Try a Triceratops. Yeah, you come out to that noise. He's like, oh, God damn it. Look at the turbos. Why'd you release me right for this clown? Tarbos are fighting each other. I think this guy is modified, but I don't know. Oh, he's not modified enough, that's for sure. <laughs> Ooh, nice vocals. Doesn't have the clicks. I mean, Fairy does, but Tarbo doesn't have his clicks, which is interesting. Now, how much damage did you do to that Tarbo? Mm, not too bad. Oh, looks like Tarbo's gonna finish the job. So, is it gonna be the same animation, pretty much? Yep. That's a shame. I mean, he can barely fit his mouth around him. Which, I do appreciate they're not stretching out his mouth too much. Oh, God. 
But they could have easily used, like, the hidden venture animation where, like, it rolls over. Like, I think it's... Does it do it to both the Carno and the Rex? I know it does it to the Carno, but I can't remember if it's for the Rex. Oh, God. Oh, a hidden adventure one is going... Oh, nope, just sizing each other up. Oh, but Triceratops is going for it. Will this be different from T-Rex's? Yes, but it is the same as his goat animation. Ooh, that's a nice shot, just in the trees. Hide in the trees! Oh god, the goat's out. Oh my god, is he going after the... He's going after the goat. <laughs> Run, people! Don't get caught in the crossfire! Unless... Oh, wait, no, he's committed. He's going after that goat. Well, he is quite hungry. Oh, and looks like this guy's giving out, too. The first two to be born in this game are the first two to make their way out. You have them in the open! Run them down! You've got them on the street. Run them down! You've taken the benches. Run them down! Oh my gosh, come on somebody. Why are they expanding all the way to the borders? Come on, you're catching up to them. Please eat somebody. Show me what kind of animations you have. Please. There we go. Oh. Oh, he missed him. Oh my god. Oh, the wait was worth it. Not to those people, but to me, that. So he misses them. Oh, God, excuse me. Let's try that again. He misses them, and then he, like, snatches them up when they try and run. Oh, he's running through! He's gonna barrel them! Oh, come on, get a lineup of them. Oh, who's he picking? He's got someone sniffed out. Oh, oh, oh he kicked one... Oh my god, he's missing all the bowling balls. I mean, pins, whatever. He's on a mission, but he's got to get someone. Please tell me he's not running back in. You little scamp. You're fired. God, is Tarbosaurus's name meaning now lazy or something? Because he's seriously being lazy. Oh god, we got the stupid, weird, tilty thingy. What's going on? Oh, okay, that's badass looking, that touch. Why is this thing rotating so much? Hold on. Hold on, uh, help. Help, I, I'm tilting. I swear I haven't been drinking. Bad. Oh, I just want to see you eat people. Is that too much to ask? Oh, bless him. Oh, you can't make me mad, Turbo. With that, you little puppy roar and roll and whatever words matter, Austin. Yes! Ooh, a snap. And hold on, let's get into capture mode. Let's... Oh, God. Bye, I don't know, call again. Maybe we can get a thumbnail with this. Ooh, hoo, 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 hoo. He's got a little tap tap. Oh, look at him. It's like he's matching. He's like, oh, we're doing the tappy dance, tappy dance. What is wrong with me, guys? I've lost it. Send in the helicopters. Take me away. Take me to the place. But... Let's, uh, see if we can get this in slow-mo. Ooh. Yep, that's me. And you're probably wondering how I got here. It's a long, less painful story than its conclusion. Oh, oh, God. Uh, uh, help? Help! Where am I? Oh, God. I I just went to the place above. I am God. My God damn. What was that? Ooh, look at that tarp. 
Oh, that's the pose from the show, definitely. I mean, no, I would. I would just be like, take me away. Ouch, that hurts. Oh, snap. Oh, let's see if we can get a thumbnail like that. Oh. Oh, uh, she's... What? <laughs> she looks so disappointed. <laughs> Look at her face. She's like, Ugh, I should have came here on a Friday, not a Thursday. This is too extreme. Also, is that scales on his... Oh, no, it looked like scales on his horn or something. He's like, delicious. And <laughs> just... <laughs> the misery, the rage, the disappointment. One star review? Well, screw you. Tarmo, finish the job. boy. But before we go, guys, I just want to say that we got to cover one more thing on this, and that is my personal ranking of these guys in conclusion to seeing all that they have to offer, or at least most of it. There's probably some animations or behavioral traits that I've missed, but I think I'm going to go with my original ranking of hype and say that at the bottom of the list is probably the Gigantoraptor due to the fact that it doesn't really do anything against anything smaller than it, unfortunately. Unfortunately, except for probably raptors and stuff, but that's like pack hunting, so that doesn't really count, I guess. Um, then I would ha probably have to go with Tarbosaurus, because while I d don't like its um, design in comparison to the other three, I think that its behaviors and such make it stand out a little bit better, despite the fact that it is like a smaller version of a T-Rex, realistically but they managed to make it stand out a lot more. Then I've got to go with my boy Utah Raptor at number two, though it's really close between him and Concavenator, but Concavenator, Concavenator, sorry if I can speak properly, is number one for me just on the fact that he's a little bit more unique. I think the Utah Raptor having the Velociraptor barks, though changed in pitch tone, I still think that's a little bit cheap in my opinion. Other than that, they are probably equal for me. I probably will switch later on in my ranking for these two because they are so close. They are absolutely gorgeous. Their patterns are to die for. But yeah, that's my ranking, guys, and pretty much what I expected it to be. Concavenator was just the one I was so excited because I never thought we were going to get it. Then again, I didn't think the same for Utahraptor, uh, more so for Utahraptor. Concavenator had a film appearance slightly, even though it was a maquette, so it had a chance. But I want to know, guys, leave in the comments, what is your ranking of all of them so far? Do you agree with my ranking of them, or are you guys a little bit different? Leave in the comments what your guys are. I'm really interested in hearing, and of course, tell me what you guys are going to use these guys for as soon as possible and as always guys stay safe and also before I 
give an outro, we kind of have to finish the video properly. So uh, let's get back to your regular scheduled program after we see this cute little animation. That was so cute, he's trying to sleep, but he can't. But that is going to have to be the end of the DLC of the Predator Pack, guys. It is absolutely fun, and I just want to ask the first question. What species are you going to use first in your parks? Is it going to be the big daddy of Tarbosaurus? That sounds so wrong, but whatever, I'm going with it. We'll call it the big mama jump. No, no, that doesn't work. What is wrong with me? We'll just say big boy. Big boy Tarbosaurus, the swift and cunning raptor of cuteness. Then again, this guy's cute as well. The conquering concavenator, as I like to call it. Or, what was the other one? Oh, the big turkey of Gigantoraptor. Leave in the comments which species you're going to be using in your parks first. I already know which one I'm using first, because I'm already working on a little exhibit speed build for him. But, until then, if you've enjoyed this video, guys, you know the drill. I'd appreciate the like and the hit to the subscribe button to join the hunt if you guys have appreciated this. I will be doing the free update very shortly. And until next time, stay safe until the next fight. Bye-bye.